everyone welcome back to my channel for today's video i am going to be unboxing a sephora haul i got some products on sale from president's day and they just came in the mail and i'm so excited to show you guys what i got and i am a sephora employee but all of these opinions and views are all of my own also if you guys are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button it helps me a ton for this product haul i did get all of these products on clearance or it was kind of like a deal set. I'm going to go ahead and start off with my first product that I got. I picked up the Sephora Favorites Hello Bag. So this one retailed for, I think it was like $28. So it didn't really have a high retail value. The other one that's on the site right now, I think it's like a $44 retail value, something like that. For these bags, you get six samples and you can kind of see the products before you purchase it. So you can see whether you want to actually get it or not. I think it's a great way to test out new products or if you like certain products, it's a good way to get like little travel sizes or minis so you can have extra of them. Or if you just like the products in general, I feel like it ends up being a pretty good deal. So this one I actually got for $8. They normally retail for $10, but it wasn't like listed as on sale or anything. It just was $8 flat on the website. So I don't know if they're lowering the prices for these bags or if they just have an overabundance and are trying to get rid of them but I am going to keep this for a separate video to show you guys everything that's in it but it is a great deal and it ends up being just over a dollar for each product in here the next product I got is by Clinique and this is the moisture surge sheer tint hydrator broad spectrum SPF 25 it's got mimetic shade technology and I got the shade Universal Very Light. For this one, there's somewhere between four to six shades that you can choose from, I believe. This is what the product looks like. I absolutely love, 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 love this formula. So I was playing around with this at work and I was like, I need to get this. And it was on sale. So this is what it looks like. It's like a moisturizer, but it's got the tint to it and it's got SPF and it doesn't you can smell the sunscreen maybe like a little bit, but it's not bad. But I mean, it's hard to see on camera. What I really, really, really enjoy about this is that it feels really hydrating and moisturizing on your skin. But the thing that I love about this is you rub it into your skin and it just flawlessly blends into your skin and it's not chunky. It's not patchy. It doesn't like go into your pores. It doesn't settle into your fine lines. It gives you the a little bit of sheer coverage with the extra hydration hydration and the SPF. So it gives you lots and lots of benefits without being like you have a ton of stuff on your skin. And it just, it feels amazing. I love this formulation. Now, if you like a more heavy full coverage, something that's gonna be like not showing your natural skin through it, you probably won't like this. You'll probably like the formula, the feel of it, but you probably won't like the coverage. But I have been getting into my no makeup makeup looks. I haven't been wearing too much makeup really lately. I'll throw on my mascara, do a little bit of my brows, I'll spot conceal any spots or blemishes that I have, and then I'll just go in with some powder and SPF and I'm good to go. I've been kind of making my routine pretty quick, easy, and I've just been going natural a lot the past year or so. This is just perfect for me, absolutely love it. The next product I got is by Incredible, and this is their Listen Hard Girl Real Neon Lip Paint. I'm actually gonna do a separate video I got two. I'm gonna do a separate video with these, showing you guys like a look with these. I'm really excited. I've seen mixed reviews, so I'm not sure how this is actually going to play out, but I figured it would be really fun. I also have a black light, so we can definitely have fun with this and I can do a really cool look. And I have it in the pink one, which is in She Arrived. And then I have it in the orange, which is I'm Hot Right Now. These are the two and I can't cannot wait to use these. I'm so, so excited. And I'm hoping that they work out because I've seen some mixed stuff about these. These two I got on clearance. They normally retail for $10 and they were $5. So pretty much two for the price of one while they were on sale. The Clinique Moisture Surge, I don't remember the exact price, guys, I'm sorry. I think it's normally somewhere around $40. I got it 
it for on sale somewhere around like $30. Not totally sure with that though. Today's video shout out word is neon. If you comment neon down below in the comments first, you'll get a shout out in my next video. And then with all of these awesome products, like always shopping Sephora.com, I did get to choose two free samples that you can do these with any order. I picked up the Orbi Run Through Detangling Shampoo. I get knots in my hair very, very easily. And my hair's my hair's always frizzy. My hair's always crazy. Even like I didn't wash it yesterday, but I did a deep hair mask with oil and everything the night before. So my scalp was a little bit more oily today. It feels nice, but it is a little bit oily. But still down below, I'm dry. I've been trying to figure out what products work for me. I saw this shampoo from Orbi and I was like, I have to try this because I'm hoping that it'll help detangle my hair really quickly. I've seen Orbi products. I haven't tried any yet before, so I'm excited to try this one. But I know they are so, so expensive. So I'm hoping it's gonna be like a miracle product just based on how expensive they are but I know a lot of people like their stuff so that one I was really happy to see because I've never seen any Orbi samples before and then I also picked up the Spice Bomb Infrared by Victor and Rolf. I actually chose the green one online and they sent me the red one which is okay because I didn't like the other samples as as much. A lot of them were like foundations and stuff and I just don't really need too too much anymore because I've been not wearing them as much so this was just like the best Best thing I was like I can just either wear it if I like it or give it to my family and let them use it it actually smells pretty good hmm. Maybe I'll keep it for myself. I love men's colognes, guys. If you guys don't know, I'm literally obsessed. I don't really wear women's fragrance. I always, I go for the men's. <laughs> All right, guys. So I guess that's it for this video. Pretty quick haul. Let me know what you guys thought down below. And if you guys have any products you guys want me to try, let me know as well. Today's video shout out goes out to Robert Coons. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. Thank you guys so much for watching if you guys haven't make sure to subscribe hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time i post a new video love you guys bye